When we think of a superhero, we usually think of their superpowers, such as Superman's ability to fly or Spider-Man's ability to shoot webbing. Every child has dreamed of having these skills and being able to fight crime. But superpowers are not the only way to define a superhero. If it was, numerous villains could be defined as superheroes too, right? These unique personality traits, skills, and qualities are what make up superheroes, and sometimes the actors that play them possess them as well. Subscribe to Screen Rant as we introduce you to Screen Rant's list of 10 superhero actors who can do superhero things. Jennifer Garner as Elektra Jennifer Garner showed her skills as the star of the TV series Alias from 2001 to 2006 as CIA agent Sidney Bristow. She was also the assassin Electra Nachios in the 2003 film Daredevil and the 2005 spin-off Electra. She had a tremendous work ethic, lots of training, and a plan to make her roles believable, but none more than her training with Okinawan Sai, Electra's usual weapon of choice. These blades are dangerous, but Garner practiced them daily while shooting to look like a master on film, and she can still use them to this day. Jeremy Renner as Hawkeye The bow-wielding superhero Hawkeye looks at ease when shooting a bow in the Avengers films, and there's a reason for that. Renner trained under Olympic archers to boost his skills and to ensure he was able to use a bow and arrow correctly. This can't seem to miss. Renner has said that being a traditional straight shooter isn't all that he needed to know while using an arrow. The Avengers hero also pulverizes his enemies by using a bow as a blunt weapon and spinning it like a baton as well. We're still friends, right? Another skill he's picked up along the way. Nicolas Cage as Ghost Rider Nicolas Cage's Johnny Blaze is a stunt motorcyclist who sold his soul to the devil and transformed into the vigilante Ghost Rider. Even though his face didn't turn into a skull and catch on fire in real life, he was an avid motorcyclist. He caused so much trouble on his bike that his insurance company told him he wasn't allowed to ride anymore. So he eagerly looks for films that he gets to ride a motorcycle in because he enjoys it so much. Hear the music. Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool. Ryan Reynolds' quick wit, dirty jokes, and sarcastic attitude are why fans are eager to see him play the role of Deadpool again. Boom. Luckily, he has the same mindset as his superhero character, or we would have never seen his 2016 hit film. Reynolds is very persistent. It took him a decade to get the film made, but he kept at it, just like the revenge his character pursued in the film. He had better keep that persistence and give us a few more sequels to Deadpool, or we're gonna be persistent with bothering him for them. This guy's got the right idea. Gal Gadot as Wonder Woman. Gal Gadot first portrayed Wonder Woman in 2016's Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice, and she proved to the world that she was flawless for the role. Maybe this has to do with her two year stretch in the Israeli Defense Forces, where she received weapons and combat training. Wonder Woman fights against evil just like Gadot was trained to. Next time you see Gadot on screen battling a villain, remember that she can do that in real life too. Mark Ruffalo as the Hulk. In times of stress, Dr. Bruce Banner is able to unleash a destructive anger known as the Hulk. In an interview with New York Daily News, Mark Ruffalo said he could relate to the Hulk because he himself had a lot of anger issues in his 20s. Ruffalo said, There was a time if you came into my apartment, there were pictures and posters hanging in very odd places where they were covering fist holes through walls. We're glad he was able to use that anger in the Avengers films and start punching holes in enemies instead. Hugh Jackman as Wolverine Hugh Jackman is arguably the best actor to ever play Wolverine, and since he's been playing the character for over 12 years, we feel that the fans and the studio definitely agree. Not only does he prepare with ruthless workouts, but he's also trained in martial arts, including samurai sword fighting. Jackman's skills as a martial artist make his role more believable, and give us another reason to not want to mess with him in real life. We are definitely going to miss him as Wolverine. Robert Downey Jr. as Iron Man Robert Downey Jr. is Tony Stark, and when he dies, his tombstone will most likely have both names on it. He's rich, he has a fashion flair, he knows how to throw a party, and he attributes much of his success to his father. Still, in real life, he has hero instincts. When a woman gashed her leg badly and onlookers stood shocked, it was Downey who took charge. He helped control the bleeding, kept her distracted, and directed people to call an ambulance and get her water. He stayed until help arrived, ruining his suit, but helping a very grateful woman. Taylor Kitsch as Gambit The film X-Men Origins Wolverine is arguably the weakest of the X-Men franchise, but that doesn't have to do with co-star Taylor Kitsch. 
Since he was playing Gambit, he was able to show off some of his card tricks. He learned how to trick shuffle and perform card tricks just for the role. Sadly, we won't see any more card tricks from him, since he isn't cast in the upcoming Gambit film. You have a metal arm? That is awesome, dude! Tom Holland as Spider-Man. Spider-Man is one of the most athletic superheroes in the MCU due to a bite from a radioactive spider. The newly cast Spider-Man, Tom Holland, showed off some of his skills in Captain America Civil War, and fans were excited to see him perform stunts. I don't know if you've been in a fight before, but there's usually not this much talking. All right, sorry, my bad. But not all of his stunts were done with cables and CGI. Holland is a trained dancer, and he's also been training with stuntmen for his upcoming Spider-Man films. He recently showed a video of himself performing a backflip while nailing the Spider-Man pose. It's not easy. What do you think of our video? Did we skip over any other superhero actors who can do superhero things? Sound off in the comments below, and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more fun videos. Thanks for watching.